To go out the door. Yep, so she listened to us anyway. Good job. Doing a little bit more proofing today. Um, piggybacking on yesterday's play session. We'll probably ask for a down. Wow, good girl. She's going to go right into that other room. <laughs> That'll give a good recall opportunity. Whoa, yeah, were you beeping? Yeah, nice. Yeah. That's a good girl. Yeah. I know it's wet out there. Yes, it's raining today. You're a good girl. She is, she, she used to be just constantly looking for other options. Where can I run away? Where can I go? Where can I hunker down? What can I do instead of listen? <laughs> Good girl. Opening up doors, seeing what'll get her to trigger. She ran in there yesterday and, and recalled out. Good girl. Oh, good girl. She wants to go in there. Watch. So as soon as Josh opens it, she run in. Yep. She just wants to hunker down. There's a recall out. Good job. The important thing is that she's prioritizing what we're asking her to do. She still wants to go in there. Wow, good girl. Good job. Shake it off. She likes food too. Yeah, wow. genius, wow. genius. Wow. Using the pack to help teach her down, although yeah. she she seems like she already knows it. Probably, and also the context of the food. Yeah. Helps a lot. Remember down with her housemate, Sadie? Down, I do. This is a much easier session okay. so down. far. She says, I'm going to ignore. I'm just going to stare out the window. Yeah. Good girl. Yeah, that was excellent. <laughs> I'm just going to stare out the window and pretend like he didn't say anything. <laughs> Some dogs will start sniffing. She just started staring. He can't think about it. He can't <laughs> One piece of kibble. Break. Yay! Oh, that is not oh, our whole goal of today is to teach and promote down. 
especially for her, who she likes to run away like that, right? I wanted to enter it with it being when you're thinking about running, downing is an option, like re relaxing is an option. Because I've seen her, I want to run out the door. But if I can't run out the door, I want to go out this door. And if I can't go out that one, I want to go in the kennel, right? So I'm teaching her right now, um, when you feel that way, you can just lay down like that, right? Okay, good, good girl. So she's, used, she's doing it on her own now. Um, she put herself in that down when she was thinking about maybe going out the door or something. All right, and that's because the only time I was using recall was when her brain went into flight. That was it. I wasn't doing reps, extra reps. And then that produces her coming to me eventually and staying, right? And that's the first step. And then that, and then how I enter the down is the same way. She's gonna want to, a, a dog who wants to run is gonna want to run. Once she's done exploring that, then I show her the down is an option, right? I, I could use place. I could say place is an option, right? Or, or the kennel, I could do whatever I wanted to promote her to use to show her that it works, right? Through the anxiety of not knowing where to go. Um, but I wanted to do down, because with her, you might need it wherever. She, she might need it wherever. This is actually more for her, that she can start using the down, that she can start using place as a coping skill for when she's getting anxiety to run. Okay? Good. And I see that she's, she's learning that. Um, Lexi. Break. Yay! Yeah. <laughs> Good girl! <laughs> she still wants to go into the kennel. Or anywhere, if I open that door, probably. Good. Good. But she's like, if I can't roll the roost, I just want to run away. I don't want to play. <laughs> yeah, at home, I do whatever I want, and it's great. But I don't listen. In here, I have to listen, so just Ooh. get me out of here. <laughs> She runs at home though too, does she? Oh, they could never let her off leash. Never. never. Yeah. So never. Sometimes with dogs like this, it, it's... Good girl. They, 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 see, so that's her using it. Good girl. So we talked about this in the other mm -hmm. video. She was starting to use it. Um, and every time she relaxes, I always say, you're doing such a good job. Yeah. She really is having a nice turnaround. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. She's a good girl. She is. Oh, yeah. Her, her, uh... Flight attempts were just a little bit more than the average dog. Oh yeah, the intensity yeah. of uh, the intensity, the number. the number. Yeah, yeah, like uh, every session I mean, she's tried. Yeah, it was a good while. Yeah, yeah. I would say that just recently she started. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah. Here's the thing: is that she was running with uh, with serious intent to run away. Yeah. For some dogs, they just pull through. The and and think about it: she has that found as a stray, so she's got that history of like ultimate freedom. Yeah. yeah. Where. She does have that experience where other dogs are like, they've yeah. never had it. Yeah, they don't even know they can. Yes. Away, you know? um, yeah, she she knew what she was doing. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, but you know what? It, she's she's really turning around. Yeah. Now when I let her out there, she's looking at me. She's yep. following me. We're going somewhere together. Um, and she's almost ready to go off property mm -hmm. um, and start doing it in the real world, which yeah. is where, you know. So and she finds me as a safe spot, which is great. She's learning to use the down. She'll learn to use the walk and stuff. Uh, and did she have problems being in the kennel at home? I don't think so. She's all right? Yeah. All right, good. She's been good here, too. Yeah, she's really, really good here. Really, yeah. Very good. Uh, she doesn't listen. Some notes while we're on here, while we have her. But I noticed since she's been here. Um, she she will snap at a dog if they get in her face and, and you don't get her away, right? Yeah. She, she wants to correct them to maintain space. She hasn't shown any interest here yet in... Playing or, or being she's out of her super comfort zone. social, right? She, so she'll tell the dogs to kind of take a hike. Um, I talk to her about it, and you know she lets me deal with it, so it's good. Like she, it's not like she's gonna snap immediately. If a dog keeps pasturing or whatever, and we don't see it, she's likely to. She'll show teeth. She's trying to just tell the dog to go away. Yeah. Right. And so, um, what I told, what I'm telling her is, is if I see a dog pasturing, you I'll send it away. Yeah. Just wait for me, and that's what I've taught him yep. you know, and all my other dogs. So. But then that's my responsibility to advocate for her to don't like dogs. Pass her. She's a little older. She's an adult. She doesn't, you know, some dogs, they don't want that puppy. They don't need it. They don't want the play. They're just kind of annoyed by it. Okay? And she's already had puppies, you know, so you know she's probably corrected her puppies for the, the same nonsense. So she knows how to do it. Um, which is a good thing. She's not going to, I haven't seen her overdo it. Yeah. But it's still something to look out for. If she's higher stress, she, she might overdo yeah. it, right? Yeah. Uh, that's what Sadie used to do, too. Yeah, they, they know how to look. Yeah. Real bad. They don't take a snap and like flip up the lips and it looks real nasty. But, yeah. Uh, a dog who knows how to correct, 
generally doesn't work, but this still doesn't want, we don't want her to feel like she has to worry about that. Right. Okay, good. I always want her to feel like when she comes to me out in a, a social environment or anything outside of our house, when she comes to me, I'll keep everything yeah. away, people, dogs, or whatever. I can tell when she's saying, I just want to be left yeah. alone. And that just puts her at ease. Yeah. And it actually gives a little bit of confidence too. Mm -hmm. yeah. Oh, good girl. Great one. Yeah, she's a good girl.